hydrogen bonding at the end of this lecture i will teach you top exam oriented questions before starting the lecture click on the subscribe button and get access to our hundred of conceptual lectures for free now what is hydrogen bonding well consider a single molecule of hydrogen fluoride we know that hydrogen and fluorine atoms are chemically combined due to covalent bond hydrogen and fluorine atoms mutually share one pair of electrons and form a single molecule of hydrogen fluoride and this molecule fluorine is highly electronegative than hydrogen the electronegativity of fluorine is 4.0 and the electronegativity of hydrogen is 2.1 when we calculate the electronegativity difference of hydrogen fluoride we get 1.9 this is very large difference in electronegativity as a result of this fluorine atom being highly electronegative pulls the shear pair of electrons more towards itself than hydrogen the electronic cloud tilt towards fluorine atom and partially negative charge appears on fluorine and partially positive charge appears on hydrogen so therefore we say that hydrogen fluoride is highly polarized molecule now consider another molecule of hydrogen fluoride like this molecule it also has partially negative pole and positive pole here there are two highly polarized molecules now listen carefully The negative pole of this hydrogen fluoride molecule attracts the positive pole of this hydrogen fluoride and attractive force produces between them let me repeat it the negative pole of this hydrogen fluoride molecule attracts the positive pole of this hydrogen fluoride molecule and attractive force produces between them This attractive force between these two molecules is called hydrogen bonding. So hydrogen bonding is not a chemical bond, rather it is intermolecular forces between molecules. The word inter means between. The hydrogen bond is attractive force between molecules. Also remember that covalent bond is intramolecular force. The word intra means within so covalent bond is a force within atoms therefore remember that hydrogen bonding is the attractive force or intermolecular forces between highly polarized molecules like hydrogen fluoride now let me ask you does hydrogen bond exist in all hydrogen compounds like methane ethane and propane well the answer is absolute no hydrogen bond doesn't exist in these compounds because carbon is less electronegative for instance let we should calculate the polarity of carbon and hydrogen bond the electronegativity of carbon is 2.5 and the electronegativity of hydrogen atom is 2.1 When we calculate the electronegativity difference between these two atoms we get 0.4 it is very small difference the bond between carbon and hydrogen is nonpolar so all these molecules are nonpolar and hydrogen bond doesn't exist in these compounds now what are the compounds in which hydrogen bond exist well remember this mnemonic nof I mean nitrogen, oxygen and fluorine. When hydrogen forms a covalent bond with these three elements, hydrogen bond exists between their respective molecules. For example, hydrogen bond exists in ammonia, NH3, water, H2O and hydrogen fluoride, HF. No hydrogen bond exist between molecules of ammonia hydrogen bond exist between molecules of water and hydrogen bond exist between molecules of hydrogen fluoride thus note it down this mnemonic nof and remember that hydrogen bond only exist in ammonia water and hydrogen fluoride now let me teach you some bullet questions regarding hydrogen bonding What type of bond is a hydrogen bond? Remember that hydrogen bond is not a chemical bond. 
हाइड्रोजन बॉन्ड इज इंटर मोलिक्यूलर फोर्सिस बिटवीन मोलिक्यूल्स सेकेंडली विच इज स्ट्रॉगर डायपोल डायपोल फोर्सेज आर हाइड्रोजन बॉन्डिंग वेल बोथ हाइड्रोजन बॉन्ड एंड डायपोल डायपोल फोर्सेज आर इंटर मोलिक्यूलर फोर्सेज बिटवीन मोलिक्यूल्स बट रिमेंबर दैट हाइड्रोजन बॉन्ड इज द स्पेशल टाइप ऑफ डायपोल डायपोल फोर्सेज हाइड्रोजन बॉन्ड इज टेन टाइम्स स्ट्रॉगर देन ऑल डायपोल डायपोल फोर्सेज थर्डली is a hydrogen bond stronger than a covalent bond the answer is no hydrogen bond is 20 times weaker than covalent bond or you can say that covalent bond is 20 times stronger than hydrogen bond fourthly why does water have a high boiling point than hydrogen sulfide if you see these both molecules h2o and h2s they are very similar but water has high boiling point than hydrogen sulfide it is because water contains hydrogen bonding and hydrogen sulfide doesn't contain hydrogen bonding this was all about hydrogen bonding